Hi guys, Patrick here, and today on Path of a Legend we've got Cameron Azy. Most of you will know him for playing for Juventus throughout most majority of his career, but also very importantly he won the World Cup, well 2006 World Cup with Italy, which is of course why he's a very highly regarded player, as he had a pretty stunning career to be fair as a player. But many people don't know he was actually born in Argentina and instead decided to play for Italy. But he started off his career at a Argentinian club, however it's not in FIFA and its name was Alastovsivi. So I've put his first club which he actually played for which was in Mexico which is Laguna so I've got the Duena and Quintero. He went on to move to two more Argentinian clubs however they're not in the game as well. So then, after that, he went to Cruz Azul. I don't think I pronounced it right, but oh well. But I've got Araujo and uh, Coran, Coro, Corona at goal. Then he went actually over to Italy to play for Verona. So I've got Carosa over there at left mid. Then, after playing pretty well for uh, Verona, he actually went to Juventus, which was the peak of his career where he actually made 224 appearances and scored a whopping, well, not really a whopping, but 27 goals as a centre midfielder. Then he went over, kind of, only made 11 appearances, uh, I mean 7, sorry, appearances for them, but he went over to Stuttgart in Germany. And then he went to another Argentinian club, which yet again is not in the um, ultimate team, well, in ultimate team, so I guess FIFA's going to have to have to put in a few more um, Argentinian clubs in the game. Oh, sorry about that. And then finally he went to Racing Club, which is where he is now. And he's at a right old age at 36. So getting into the squad, at goal of course we have Corona. All round very good keeper, actually has some pretty good handling, made some quite stunning saves for me. Then my two centre backs, which are both Mexican, we have Orojo, who played actually very well for a 69 rated player. He actually plays more like a goal with high pace, high defending and high heading. He even scored a header for me. Next one we've got Rodriguez from Stuttgart. He's got 65 pace, which is a little bit slow, but he makes up for it with his 77 defending, which I thought was a lie. His tackling was very smooth and precise. Next one we have Molinara, who also plays the Stuttgart from Italy, 84 pace, 74 passing, 74 dribbling and 73 defending, very solid all round um, left back here, very good attacking and defending, so he's quite a good player there. Then at right back we have Kakeres from Juventus, from Uruguay, all round very solid stats, his lowest stat being 60 shooting but that's not too much of a worry as the rest of his stats are 70 plus which is very solid for a, a right back and he also has a high defensive work rate so he's always going to be back there helping out in defence which is very important for the, some of your defenders to have. At right mid we have Pepe who has 4 star skills, only scored me 1 goal in 6 games however was very important in the build up play for this team, made some solid passes, good pace, good shooting and good dribbling. And at centre mid we have Pelletieri from Racing Club, the same club as Cameron Nasey. He's quite slow and I have to admit I thought his defending stats were pretty poor, however he had some good positives um, which were his dribbling and his passing which I thought were very good, kind of you could say gold like as I actually found him that good. He was quite good at central of the park in terms of passing, like really a good playmaker. Then at left mid, we have Caruso from uh, Verona. And I was a bit unsure about this guy. He was all right. He could cut in and shoot. However, only scored me one goal in six games. I think it would fare much better in the silver tournaments. Got good pace, good shot, good passing and dribbling. Only three stars though. skill. So then at central attack mid, we have Cameron Nasey. Very, very good player. Really good, 78 pace, 73 dribbling, 65 shot, which is only let down, 66 shot and 69 heading, plus those four star skills, and he scored me three goals in six games, and all his goals were pretty amazing. Two long shots from outside the box and a free kick. Can't really complain with that. Really good playmaker. I think he would be better at centre mid because it was a bit slow getting up the pitch, but apart from that, I can't recommend this guy enough. If you've got a silver Italian team, throw Cameron Nasey in there. He's absolutely stunning. Then my other centre attacking mid with Le Duena. This guy was really good last year as a silver player. As a goal player, he's kept his same, I'd think, um, shooting, dribbling and passing stats. 
stats, which were all insane last year, plus those four-star skills. However, he's lost his pace, and he really struggles as a goal to keeping up whilst when trying to attack against the likes of Chiellini, Thiago Silva, and such like that. So he kind of he isn't very good in the goal um, tournament, so he isn't really a good player, sadly. But then again, his shot is very good, and if he does have the space, he can provide very good balls. Anyway, finally, up top, strike cart, we have Quintero, 17k, he's from um, Santos Laguana, and he is also from Colombia, he's a really good silver player, can't recommend him enough, 4 goals in 6 games, pretty solid for a silver player against goals, of course, 5 star skills, 4 star weak, but very, very good player, and I've used him in many squads before, that, yeah, he's just a really good player all round. So, guys, I hope you enjoyed the squad, the gameplay should be coming on now, and... Like I said, it's part of the Legend Squad for Cameron Lazy, featuring all his past teams and the current team he plays for. I hope you enjoyed. Overall, it's quite a solid team. I won four games in well, I won four games in six games in total. First two games I lost with the team. I was trying to get used to it. I found it a bit weird how it um because I'm not too sure about four five one. But over the last four games with the team, I actually found it pretty good and won them. So thanks for watching, guys, and have a very nice day. I'll find